Uh, hey there, it's me, Floofy. Uh, hey, how are you? We're back with, with Echo. It's a little loud there. Can we turn that down a little bit? That's better. Yeah. I don't want to have it too loud, it's gonna mute me. Yes, we're back with Echo. Uh, boy oh boy, this game is something, ain't it? Uh, let's continue, please. Black scales and PJs and tough defer. Okay, so that's the two. That's um, that's Flynn and DJ on their way to save the day. Yes. No, just do it. No, come on. Make it so there is no town. Heather, how are you gonna do that, bro? You're gonna drop the A bomb? I recently got this brand of sparkling water. I don't know what language it's in, but it's delicious. But she's not staring at the corners, I see. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh. Uh-oh. Jeez Louise, Mika. You good, man? You good, man? No. Peachy. Mika, you just got shot. How are you okay, bro? I don't want to look at that no more. Me neither, man. Man. Look at this tank top. It's so terrible. Is that Frank? Is that Frank? Hi, buddy. Oh my gosh. Hi. What are you doing here? Oh, I know. I know. It probably smells like gamer sweat in this room. Oh, it's terrible. It's terrible. What are you doing? That's my dog, Frank. That tank top must be so terrible. Ugh. Sorry, I just got a funny text. Nothing about this is funny. This is actually a very serious moment, but I just got a funny text on my phone. Oh, boy. Hey, so we finally got Carl back. My goodness. Big cloven idiot. I'm surprised he's not dead, man. Oh, wow, Flynn. Jeez. Uh oh, another message. I'm taking it. Go get him some water. Yeah, go get him a doctor, too. He's probably like... He's hurt. He is. I mean, he's got blood on his chest, man. He's all banged up, man. He's got this really nice form, though. You know what I mean? He's got the biceps. In fact, it's, it's really just started, if you think about it. What? Come on, Flynn! Come on, Flynn! Join the group hug! Let's go! Come on! Come on! Yeah! Come on! Come on! Come on in! Yeah! That's what I talk about! Let's go, Flynn! That's my boy! Yeah, he looks good with a smile. Oh, that was a transition. Oh man, he loves the tapioca pudding, it seems. Well, 
I mean, he's not using it. What am I so <laughs> guilty of? Oh my goodness. 15 minutes is not that long considering what the dude's been through. I mean, come on. Are you addicted to fentanyl, Mika? You got shot. Yeah, you got shot, dude. You need something. Just hurts a bit when you stretch the skin. Okay. Take some leave or something, dude. I don't know. That's interesting. Okay, so taking a leave then, dude. Do something. I love Ska. I don't know what that is, bruh. What is that? Shut up, Toby. Who's Toby? This guy? Are you Toby, TJ? Oh, it is TJ. Wow, you're dead naming people now, you psycho. Uh-oh, dead by daylight, man. I'm getting the flashbacks. Oh, boy. It's been a long time since I played, though. I'm not worried about it. Does it? Uh-oh. What do you want? Uh, what's his name? I forgot it. Well, the guy. We know who the narrator is now. The, the spooky narrator. Wow, Flynn. Always cussing up a storm. I am gonna be in trouble when I have to do Flynn's past or uh, Flynn's part, Flynn's storyline, and I have to censor like 80% of the whole thing because he keep he cusses like four times a sentence. What are you doing stomping around my bed? You big sausage roll. He looks like a loaf of bread that's burned on one end. He literally does. I'm talking to you, Frank. Come here. Give me some pets. You're so cute. You're so cute. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Ah, oh, pets are the greatest, aren't they? The dam. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. What do you think, Flynn? Einstein? Do something about it. I don't know, man. She's got the instructions. Oddly composed. I don't know. Get that bracelet off your hand, Leo. Oh, boy. Hi, what are you still doing here? Wait, what do you want? Yeah. Sure about that? Uh oh, Mika, you're throwing your hat in the ring now? Bro, everyone here is most likely already gone anyway. Ah, fine. Maybe. Wow, Flynn, you're such a pessimist. Uh. 
<laughs> oh, I love I <laughs> I love when they do that. Just the look, and then they're already on their way. Oh man, I love when they do that. Holy cow. Ah, uh, no, he don't have a heart. He's a heartless guy. Oh. Hmm, he's got connections. I see. Ooh. Hey, how'd you do that? Evokes, that's a strong word. Hey, I don't know, man. Bleeding heart. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I am a little soft. Leo wasn't kin. Wow, Flynn. You're even taking Leo's side now. I thought you were supposed to be my man. What other what choice did I have? Oh, boy. Got the music coming in. Oh boy. Bro, they're gone. They are gone. Oh man, the music is slightly distorted too. Oh, that's so freaky. Oh, freaky, freaky. Why do I still have that? This is definitely different from the internal scary narrator guy. Uh oh. How are you? Why are you asking me, second mysterious narrator? This is definitely not the first mysterious narrator. It's a it's a new one. I can tell because of the font. How are you? Why are you asking me? I'm terrible. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, well. I guess you can read my thoughts. That's comforting. Is it really? Things will get better soon. Now that's a piece of good news. I like this internal. Can we, can we fire the first guy and hire this one, please? Oh my goodness, the music. The music! Not your fault? What do you mean? What's not my fault? My intentions are pure? Uh, okay. I would not call Chase the most pure of intended, but he's a good person. Sure. I'll say that. For a loving act. Oh, he's talking about Sydney, isn't he? Or she, I guess. This, this narrator is technically a girl because she said womanly voice. I wish we could talk more, but yeah, place it to be. Is this the spirit of Sydney talking to me? No, that'd be awesome. Because at this point, Sydney would be a grown person at this point, right? So, man, if that's the spirit of uh, Sydney talking to me through the baby monitor, man, that'd be so cool. Oh, 
new scenery. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, man. There's something hiding in one of these dark spots, bro. All I'm waiting is for someone to take it to the... The freaking... What you call it there? Photoshop. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. Fascinating. I don't want to be here neither, man. That's a terrible idea, Jenna. You're gonna get shot at. It's okay, Flynn. You don't have to know what I'm talking about. Well, that's a theory. Thank you, Jenna. I appreciate your assist. You're just gonna sit there and snore all video. Really, Frank? Wow, he is. He's just gonna sit there and snore all video. <laughs> oh, what a cutie. Charlie horse symbol? What is that? Oh. Hmm, okay. <laughs> oh, I thought it was kind of funny. Come on, man. Hey, I asked. Chase did ask, didn't he? Flynn was just doing his job, man. Thank you, Flynn. Flynn is definitely the kind of person I want to have at my back, man. Dude would make with the, like the ultimate bouncer. He even kind of looks like a bouncer, don't you think? Like maybe he's a little dressed a little too casual to be a bouncer, but if you if you like put a vest on him, he'd be a great bouncer. Man, is this really oh no. Is this really the right time to talk about it? Keep it that way. Thank you, Flynn. That's a great way to put it. Wow. I feel like I might have to save. Take Carl's advice. What's his advice? He mumbled suplexer. Thank you, Carl. Oh, Carl, he never changes. Even after being horrifically abused, he still is the same old Carl we know. Carl, good to have him back. Yes, sirree. Good to have good old reliable Carl back. Gosh, dang, he is snoring up a storm back there. Oh, it's hard not to keep a straight face when talking about that rascal. Yeah, here we go. Hi, with a squiggly line. Can't stop me. Maybe, I don't know, man. Maybe we should back off a little bit. She's got heat. Gonna blast us. Awakened dream. Oh yeah, is that right? It was peace. It's had to be done. It has to be done. I don't know. It was quiet. No. watching can hear him snoring back there. And they understand. No, not really, to be honest. You do not you don't, do you? Nope, not really. I knew it. Well, sorry. You 
broke into my house. Can you at least pull your shirt up a little bit? Do you have to have so much showing? I'm much more of an, a man of uh, less timid dressing. You know what I mean? I wear a sweater at all times. You're bad, just like the rest of them. Maybe you should take a look in the mirror, bruh. Huh? Mika, you already tried to talk her down. It didn't work. You again? Goodness gravy. <laughs> oh, what a guy. Keith, we're talking about Keith again. Oh boy. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm getting weird leaving. Bro, I'd leave. I'd get out of Dodge. I'm out. I'm about to peace out, man. I'm not doing that. So you never saw how bad it got. Well, he's here now. You don't have to watch it happen. He's here watching it happen right now. Look at all that fluff on his skin, man. Ah, it makes me proud. Well, what are you going to do about it? Well, you probably did that yourself. Yeah, it's nothing stopping you, dude. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. burn figure. Oh no! It's the demon! Uh-oh. Heather, look out! Uh-oh! 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 Uh oh no. Oh, man. Bro, do something! Uh-oh. Oh, no. Flynn! Flynn! Uh-oh. Jenna, I thought you hated your family. What are you talking about growing up fortunate? Incredible, some incredible people and other things. That's not very fortunate. That sounds pretty typical. Looking out for me. Alright, he's dead. Let's go! Let's go, Crab Rave! Let's go! Heck yeah! Dude. Wait, how do you know that? Jenna, how do you know that? Do you know this thing? Is this demon something you know? I, those aren't people I want to like me, though. Those are people I want to have stay far, far away from me. Why are you saying they're good? They're not. You should feel terrible, Heather. It's true. Okay, fine. I have to give this point to Jenna. That's very much true. Yeah. Nah. Bro, let the demon take her. The demon's hungry. It wants to eat. Oh, man. Oh. It's gone. Well. We... We banished the demon, question mark. It probably just left. It's like, I'm out. <laughs> I can't brainwash anybody. I'm out of here. I don't want to do this no more. Yeah. I wonder if that demon has a character sprite like the rest of the people do. Because he's, he's going to be in every single storyline. Like, we, we know that. But, I don't know. 
Out of bullets. It was out of bullets all along. What is that? What is that word even? Ooh, scenery. Hey, wait a minute. Was this made in a uh, Krita? I think this was made in Krita because I recognize these exact star shapes. This is a pen design in a Krita. A uh, four point or no. Is it Krita? It might be IBS paint. I think it might be IBS paint. Because I recognize these um these stars, these four point stars from one of my drawing services. I just don't remember which one. And this aspect ratio reminds me of IBS paint too. So maybe, maybe, maybe I just uncovered something very interesting. But I know these star shapes. I recognize these star shapes, definitely. Ah, we got the Mormons, I see. Oh my gosh, Leo, please leave me alone. Ugh. You know, I'm going to miss this place. After all that we've just been through, I'm very shocked, Jenna. Wow. Everybody is just like, are you crazy? You know, I was joking, right? I was about to say, Jenna, come on, man. I was expecting some laughter there. Well, Jenna, your humor has always been a little bit dry. I think you're plenty funny, Jenna. Thank you, Chase. You're such a, you're such a good person, Chase. Shut up, Chase. What did I do to you, Mika? What did I do to you? I thought you were on my side. I definitely do side with Mika, though. We gotta get out of here. Oh. We made it? Uh, what? I'm very, very confused. Because I thought from Leo's storyline that the only way to get out of Echo was by the train. So we just got out normally? I guess the demon didn't want to stop us, I guess? I don't know. Sure. I'm sure there's some very valid explanation. I still have four storylines to do. It's a big game. Ah, good. I'm not going back. Yeah, come on. Really? I didn't know his parents owned a brand of ice cream. That's probably why he's so fat. Oh, boy. Bro, can you change out your tank top? I be, I've always felt that Flynn and uh, Carl have like some sort of connection. You know what I mean?
Yeah, that's what I love about Flynn, man. Dude is immovable. You ain't never gonna see Flynn crumble, man. Also a salad. Oh, Flynn, even in such a dire time, you still keep your sense of humor. Yeah, you can- I can even tell. Man, even Flynn's having a tough time, man. Look at his expression. He's- he's having a hard time keeping it together, too. Ay ay ay. No, I gotta- I gotta at least finish this before I end this episode. We are like, five minutes left of this third line. Thanks. Yeah, I, what did I, wait, what did I do? You're welcome, question mark? He's all right. Amen, Flynn. You and me both. I, I think if there's anybody that's struggling for money, it's definitely not Carl or Flynn. Again, is, is Flynn really that struggling for money? Why is that happening? A guy with a camera tasting tragedies for profit. Dang, dude, when you put it like that, journalism sounds kind of lame, actually. Maybe I should change my major. Dang! You're even doing some self-reflection, huh? See, this is how I know that um, Chase is handling this much more than Leo's storyline is because he's still mentioning college. Versus Leo's line, he didn't even talk about college ever again, you know what I mean? I don't think he did, anyway. Who's that? Like, even he tensed up. He was like, what? What'd you say? Like, hey, hey, don't be bitter. Don't be bitter. Oh, he got a crush. Oh, he got a crush. Can lizards blush now that I think about it? I don't think they can. Because they're cold-blooded. Hi, guys. You're welcome, Mika. I mean, bro, you look like- look at you! You look like 6ix9ine, of course you look like prime jail material. Where is your shirt?! We are in a public space now, Leo! Leo, Leo, where is your shirt? Oh my goodness. Yeah. You see some oddball customers. Yeah, I've seen a couple oddballs in my time. But when I worked, uh, when I worked where I did. A side of bacon. <laughs> There's something about Mika that's just so hilarious. He is like the perfect 16-year-old uh, hype beast, if that even makes sense. Even though he's not 16, he's a full-grown adult. He's like a 16-year-old hype beast. It's freaking amazing, bro. It's hilarious. Jenna, mind your business. Oh well, thank you, Jenna. Never mind. I've always, I'm always amused how Flynn can look so gosh dang bitter at all times. Like, even his somewhat happy face is so bitter looking. 
pink? The Kuma Lemonade's pink. Oh, pink lemonade. All right, Carl, I feel you. I, I dig with some pink lemonade. What? Uh-oh, Flynn, do you not like pink lemonade? Pink lemonade. Yeah, man. <laughs> oh, come on, Flynn. Come on, Flynn. Pink lemonade. Pink lemonade. Come on. Ugh. Oh, Flynn, don't be such a... Don't be so... Don't be so sour. Hold my arm. Bro, she's probably gone. She's probably toast. Yes, my aunt who's the mirror. Thank you for clarifying that, Flynn. Sorting stuff out. Yeah, probably. Cretan. That is absolute Cretan behavior. What are you doing, Chase? You psycho. No, Leo. Don't do it. Falling over himself, thanking Jenna over the phone. Oh, well. Yeah, great. Calling her a hero. What about everybody else? There was nothing Jenna did that got Carl saved. The reason Carl got saved was a lapse in error from the villains. We all failed to save Kyle. We just found him. I just happened to get shot for my efforts. Yeah, Mika's more of a hero than anybody else. He got shot, at least. No! No, Mika! Not the wings! Oh. Not meant to carry a full anthropomorphic person to flight. That's really lame. I just have my wings amputated at that point, dude. What's the point of having them? Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I guess I'd keep them. Kind of like a, like a paraglider. You can't fly, but at least you can slow your fall. You got spray. He sprayed you. What is he making sure you can't have kids? He spayed you. You crazy person, Mika. Had worse piercings, yeah. I could just look at your arms and know you probably had a couple piercings. I know. You probably took them out. Why is everyone suddenly so sour towards him? I call that character development. Yeah. And they had to specify and in capitals. Oh yeah, you know what? I haven't heard the spooky narrator's voice yet. After 40 years? I don't know, man. It's not that long. In the grand scheme of things, I mean. It's like half a person's life, but... I don't know. You could tell, like, a great-grandson about what, how their grandpa passed away, got hit by a car, I guess. I think Sydney's dad killed a guy. Yep, well... I don't know. Yeah. What, well, was there something wrong with Sydney? Was Sydney a troubled boy? Probably. finally separated healing up nicely and you two are finally separated you should talk about me oh man everybody at the table just immediately soured up you saw that dick yeah yeah jenna what's all that about bro
Yeah, bro. Well, that was pretty. That's pretty rich coming from you. Oh, shots fired. No. Yeah, it was, Jenna. That was a kind of rude thing to say. Yeah, I guess it isn't high school anymore. These are full-grown adults at this point. Like, we are talking people in their 20s. Right? I mean, Flynn. Flynn's like 26? He's old, bro. In contrast to the rest of these people. Talking about this. Also not. Well, at least you admit it. But on the plus side, Jenna, I did Leo's row, and uh, he threw me under a train. So, uh, yeah. Oh, wow. Look, man, even Flynn surprised. He's like, gosh, dang, so you got me surprised too, man. Oh, wow, Flynn. Oh, gosh. That's terrible. At least he finds it funny, though. You smashed up an arcade. Yeah, at least you find side of music, Mika. I guess. Yeah, he did. At least he admits it. Kind of a rebel. Kind of a rebel, kind of a psychopath, actually, Leo. A real... That's... I can't say that word, but that word right there. No, how about a real psychopath? There we go. That's the truth. Yeah, it is it is pretty bad, but no. Uh, I don't know. Ah, uh, there it is. There's that word. It, you had to say it eventually. You going to take the bracelet off now? Mika, you're so crass. I have to censor that. I have to censor that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Flynn, get me out of here. Get me out of here, Flynn. No, stop. Stop it. Thank you. Wow, Leo actually did some self-reflection. I thought he hated talking over the internet. Wow, good for you, Leo. That is some self-reflection. I could get you some harder stuff. Mika, quit it. You're not helping. Devil dog cake with a strawberry cherry and raspberry filling. Santa Eva and Bisbee and Pueblo. Mika. How are you not diabetic? Take your mind off anything. Yeah, I bet. Get you some. Uh, uh, what? Mika, that's so that's so bad. Mika, yeah, for Pete's sake, man. I'm just kidding. No, you ain't. No, oh, he's all bitter now. No, you ain't. The cake place closed years ago. Oh, that's unfortunate. Sounds really good. Aw, oh, Flynn, don't be mad because it's pink. And besides, you're a gay guy, right? Pink things should not offend you. Well, at least Flynn still got it. That was once. What? What? If your pee looks like pink nemonade, you should go to the hospital. Uh-oh. Man, Carl, you still look so rough, my boy. Look, your tank top's all wrinkled, man. You just, you don't look good, brother. There's a whole wad. 
Mika, your manners. Don't choke. Don't tell him what to do. We've been together for some time. I'm telling you, man. Who is that? So again, this re, re uh, reforms my um, my theory that we're playing as that the scary narrator, because like Chase is saying, someone is choosing these choices for him, and who is that choosing? It's me. It's me choosing. So that most likely means I'm playing as that person, right? Which is very interesting, in my opinion. French fry poking out of the corner from mouth. Ah, uh, well. You know, you really gotta consider out of any of the pads I've done so far, this one has been the least traumatic. Except maybe for Carl. But Carl is a tough guy, you know. He'll he'll survive, I think. Game, I don't care about a jukebox. Just end it already. Nuance and a mood setter. Let's take a look. Okay. Ambulance bells. Ah, yep, that's how you know this is America. I hear the music. Hi, Jenna. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Frank, oh my gosh. <laughs> I genuinely think my microphone is going to pick up on his loud, obnoxious snoring. Yeah. What do you mean, Jenna? How do you figure? What does that mean? Oh. Something in the water. Could be. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, I predicted that. <laughs> Let's go, dude. The oranges of syrup. Oh, no. That's right, Chase. You can you can help people. That's right. That's a very nice thing to say, Chase. Yeah, a little on the sappy side, I agree, but you know, well, whatever. Gets the job done, right? If Sydney were still here. I don't know, Jenna. I didn't know that. At this point, I don't even- I still don't know what species Sydney is. I think he was a hybrid. Which, that would be very interesting. I haven't seen one hybrid in this novel yet. Jenna, I just said I don't want to talk about it. That would have been nice, though. Yeah, I didn't know that. Proverbial fan. What a word. <laughs> it's so hard to take any of this seriously when I have Frank snoring at like 50 million decibels behind me. Yeah, Jenna's not the kind of scrutinize. I'm not. 
Yeah, she's not. She, she's not licensed or nothing. I'm your friend. Yeah, that's right. Well, the thing is, it's not gonna stay that way for long. She's moving, and like the moment we get back, this this trip was the the last chance. You know what I mean? Just a friend. Oh, get him, get him, Chase. Oh, get him, Chase. Put the moves on real thick. Oh. There we go. I was about to say, man, way to let a guy down, bro. Yeah, you're just doing it because it's, it's funny. I know. Hmm, it's a good point. That's one thing I really respect about her. She's very self-reflective. Biased, yeah. Really? She's gonna write in this timeline, okay. Cool. I've always wondered if the different endings were like different storylines. So in theory, there really was a storyline that Chase got ran over by a train. Which in my head canon, he just survived and got uh, metal implants. Became one of those cyborg furries that you see sometimes, you know. How do you explain the demon then, Jenna? Well, you can certainly beat them, but I don't know about running away from them. What should we pick? Is this gonna be an important choice? Let's let's, uh, let's roll it back. Save. Let's drop a save real quick. You never know. Bop. Save. Now. Man, if I picked country, that would tick everybody off. I like me some soft rock. Uh-oh. Head spirit, boys. Yeah, let's go. That was pretty good. Let's go. Yeah, we did. Ah, uh, no picture? Uh, I was about to say, there it is. Oh, damn, I hate you. You really had to use that photo. Uh, man, I knew the moment I played this game when I saw this photo. It was gonna be 